Basketball, you betcha I'm back. It's the Daily Trader and I'm ready to get after it. Did you make your team? Are you on the team? What do we have to do to get you on the team? You tell me in the comments below because it's time to go. Let's get this workout in. Right away, we got to warm up real quick. We're going to do that with some circles of that ball going around your head, around your waist, and around your legs. Let's go, man. We're going to do it a minute each. So you're going to wrap it around your head for a minute wrap it around your waist for a minute wrap it around your legs for a minute and then we're even going to go around each leg individually for a minute okay then we're going to warm up with some agilities the first one we're going to do we're going to separate those legs we're going to jump apart bring them back in 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 then we got those high knees up and over those cones and then we're going to go with our hurdle jumps over the cones as well okay that should get you nice and warmed up you got your jumping in got a little bit of a quick twitch muscle and then now we're gonna go with our broad jumps okay last one is gonna be our broad jumps you're gonna have that two foot pop and that easy land don't slam when you land don't slam when you land we're gonna go four times um, with five jumps okay four times five jumps each set and then we are going to get into our basketball and our basketball playing today we're going to go ahead and start with that drill that i love so much where you're dribbling through the basketball slamming it down sliding back picking up the other basketball we're going to do that four times okay on the sideline then right after you're going to be a little winded from doing this drill which is great and we are going to do zigzag dribbling okay zigzag dribbling you're going to start bottom corner then you're going to go from the block to the sideline to that three-point line and then back to half court and then you're going to sprint that basketball back down i want you to do this three times remember we're going to go through the legs we're going to go crossover and we're going to go behind the back all right, working it on at full speed, working on it on both sides because we got to work both hands and the directional movement of both sides. And then what I want you to do is get on the sideline and go ahead and keep that ball in your weak hand and go ahead and give me a quick 10 run on the sidelines. Remember, we're getting in shape. We're trying to feel great for these tryouts and we don't want to miss out. All right, so looking forward as we continue to do this we want to make sure we are getting to the free throw line because we want to be able to shoot them when we're tired and i think that's going to be more important than shooting them when you're fresh so go make five free throws feel good about them grab some water refresh yourself and let's get back to work basketball you we got a lot to do full court dribbling drills oh no one loves those, but I do. So we're going to sprint with that basketball going all the way full court. You're going to alternate hands. You're going to finish it on the right side. You're going to make four of those. And then you're going to finish it on the left side. You're going to make four of those. So eight total in your full court dribbling. And make sure you're keeping your head up. Make sure you're pushing that basketball out. Make sure you're going full speed. You want to give max effort because that's the part that's going to get you in shape, not the drill. Okay, so make sure you get max effort and you keep going through it. All right, now we're going to now use the baseline and we're going to start at the bottom of that three point wing and we're going to dribble around the arc full speed, working kind of that angle where you're turning the corner and then we're going downhill. So you want to work that. It's almost like if someone was on your shoulder or on your hip and you're trying to beat them. Okay, so that's what this drill represents. I want you to dribble full speed. I want you to go as fast as possible going in that awkward direction. Okay, we're going to do this three times. Okay, there and back so that you can work both hands and feel confident about it. And that is the biggest thing, right? Confidence. Okay, and then we're going to work our handle again and then work some layups. We're going to come from the wing and we're going to cross over again, go through the legs and then go behind the back. Okay, uh, now remember you're dribbling to the elbow and then you're making that counter move, all right? It gets tricky at times, but again, we're working on how fast can we go forward, how quick can we stop, change the direction, and go finish, all 
all right another drill that you're going to do in regards to dribbling somewhere and stopping will be our wing drill actually where we're going to roll the basketball out to ourselves okay we're going to catch it on the go and we're going to go full speed and we're going to work the counter the same way and then we're going to also work the jump shot there and then we're also going to work the floater so we're going to work an array of moves as far as finishing goes in this particular part of uh the drill that i'm teaching okay remember everything is a catch on the go okay so you're just working on trying to be a little bit faster than that defender just a little bit uh, more of an advantage on your step and then trying to be under control once you get to your destination of scoring right and then lastly i'm going to have you kind of not necessarily cool down but just something a little bit easier and you're going to go through that layup series remember you got your regular layups your jump stop layups your inside hand layups your same leg layup you got your reverse inside hand layup your reverse outside layup and then you can go to that free throw line once again and make five for all of the basketball you family you got to do it all right and then come on back for more all right basketball you we are going to work our footwork where we roll that basketball out and then we're going to make the layups okay we got easy footwork inside pivot bam you're going to go finish that right hand layup and then we got the same thing on the other side and then we also have the front pivot where you're going to turn and finish as well on both sides then what we would like to get into is definitely looking for uh, some shooting and so what we're going to do is we're going to go with three level shooting okay and then we're going to go back to the footwork where we're going to open up work the pull up open up uh, work the crossover open up work the hard drive and step back okay again footwork drills are important it gets you to the same place you kind of want to go with the dribbling aspect of things when trying to attack and get uh by your defender um there's a lot of different things you can use and say about footwork but it is very important and we got to continue to learn it and with that being said what i want is a footwork drill where we're playing off two you're going to make that jump stop or that stride stop you're going to show that fake and then you're going to go up and then you're going to go finish okay so that's always a good drill we're going to do that on both sides you want to make five um, on each side okay really focus on the footwork and the shot fakes and then the last drill that we're going to do is going to get you a little bit tired but i'm going to work it a little bit differently today so what you're going to do is you're going to go baseline run with it like kind of like five spot layups so you're going to do five spot layup but you're only going to do the baseline and then you're going to shoot the three so we're going to rip through make the layup then the clip is going to cut to you shooting the baseline three uh, the same way we do our running drill okay so it can be stationary or you can run from the layup spot roll it out to yourself and then catch and shoot that three okay however you feel all right and in order to move on to the next spot which will be the wing is doing the same thing you got to make both then you're going to roll it out use your footwork finish then roll it back out square up shoot okay you're going to do that at the top you're going to do it at the wing you're going to do it at the other corner uh three and then again we're looking like real good basketball players and then lastly you're going to finish with around the world shooting on from the three-point line and that's where you shoot at every spot and try to make 25 threes if you can and that's how you're going to end it basketball you i thank you so much for coming by as you always do hopefully the drills are creative enough to get you on your team and also don't remember if you don't make that team you're always a part of our team basketball you family can't appreciate you enough i am the daily trainer here in each and every day every way for the game that you love to play and uh remember this someone's always working are you <laughs>